Hello and welcome back to um, Grimshot playing Europa Ucellus 4 or EU4 which other people like to what's the name of it and um, where we took off was we're at war with him not a good news for him and these guys are becoming a pain in the ass so I'm sending my army there to help defend that location hopefully get there before the enemy do but that was they're gonna get there most likely before me and yeah I'm never gonna make it but hopefully the battle there will go hopefully on my favor just because of my general is way better than his and that Leon will hopefully be taken over after this because I think this is a defensive war Take no it was actually us attack them now let's see how this battle is going and we are absolutely destroying his army now, I am just gonna follow and hopefully stack wipe his army Sell them all into one regiment, cost less money too, for upkeep wise. Bugger. Now, we stack wiped, so that helps a lot. If I get an army in each territory and take them over before they become a problem, take it and I'll move this army. Oh, okay, odd. We call diplomat. We may not negotiate set peace with them. Okay, burger. Hopefully this won't take long for us to take that. Yep, awesome. Send him there to help them take that out. Really? Two casts here? Right here. Was not expecting that. What do you know? I actually have a big army, my ally. That's a first. Well. Wow. You know what I mean. Now, I've been thinking and thinking of getting a fleet as well. Like just some merchant ships. But I'm just not sure at the moment. I want, I want merchant ships just because of um, the trade. I can actually get a fair bit of money out of trade. And these guys are continuously pissing me off okay they are finally going down I think just these guys that are the pain now But I'll just fast forward through all the siege crap. Let's just keep on going forward. Yep, 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 okay, getting money from there, that's awesome. Yep, yep, okay, cool. Cool beans, cool beans. Let's just pause for a second. And make a fleet of light ships save. No, 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 no. Delete that. One, two, three. One, two, three. Now, yeah. I haven't got the money for it. Burger. Never mind. Get that. But I can do this. Two merchant ships. One there. Didn't grab it fast enough. But yeah, I want to start making a merchant fleet. Start working on this trade and. So, aid us in reinforcing. Oh, sweet. 
Now, my heir, is he old enough? Of course he's not. He's age 15. And we need to get him a girlfriend so he can get some priggers and have an heir. Really? I'm trying to be forced to give up 10% uh, of their income each month to pay war. This will last for 10 years. It will. You know, their treaties with Leon it will pay um, to Ilica with no Casabelli. Or suffer zero aggression, expansion, relations, penalty, or her gains. You can gain negative three. Okay, sure, you get everything. But please give me Leon. I mean, not Leon. Uh, this land. I like it. It look, it will look good in my hands, just saying. As well, I have helped you out and destroyed the enemy forces. Bugger. Now, that's a rough way out of the way. Yeah, I'll make them a rival. They have no army. And if I declare war on them... France will get involved, holy sh shit. Cool allies, enemy allies. Okay, yeah. If there's no Casabelli, then sure, why not? If I have a legitimate reason. Ooh. Actually, maybe not. Fabricate claims on them. Get rid of them. But until that happens, I need to lower my funding of the troops and actually turn off all castles. If I have any still active. No, it's not that tree. There we go. Three forts active. I don't want all these forts active. There we go. That was definitely save up a lot of money. Um, where is it? Hey, maintenance. No. Smugglers running rampant. People are finding lots of ways of getting around paying taxes and fees on moving goods. This is cutting into our income, but stopping it will cost quite a lot in the, sh in the short term. Stop them. Oh sweet, I'm negative 10 ducats. That is so awesome. And I've just taken out a loan, so yay, I'm in debt. And I have a loan to pay. Sweet. Now. Do I want to get one? Price is quite high. Nah, I'll just let it be for a bit. But, I will work on this merchant fleet of mine that I want. Come on. Here we go. I have them over here in that port. I don't know why, I just want them there. New Pope. Fuck, I've definitely forgotten about the Pope standings. <sighs> Bugger. I have no Cardinals. Oh, yeah, that's probably a bad thing. Well, that sucks for them. They're having a civil war. Hmm. Definitely sucks for them. If I declare war, they're going to call on their allies, which are them, which is army of 3k. 
Well, I can call on my allies, Gallica, to take over most of these guys. Thing is, how much of an army can I support? One more unit. I'll just put him there. Once this merchant fleet is made, and I'll put them to work, gather up my forces on this border, invade him, and perfectly cut off these guys, which I'm trying to fabricate a claim for. Why have I done that? Or do I want to take them out first? Nah, it's going to bring a useless war, which is... It's going to be one territory and no point really at the moment, so on fleet, get made. Just need one more ship. That's one more ship. Now, these ships are cold, so I don't need them at the moment. Once this last ship gets made, then, yep, cool beans, come on, move over, move over. And come on. You're not going to move over, are you? Okay. Let's start collecting trade to... What's my biggest income? There. Let's start putting, getting trade in there. Now, well, everything goes right if I. Okay. Let's put my army up to full maintenance. Let these guys recoup everything. Now, I definitely need an air. Oh, that's interesting. Saxony is quite big. But, hmm. I definitely need an air before things become a problem. At least this way I have, um, I mean, um, well, I was thinking of something else and saying com completely the opposite. I was going to say, um, at least the type of government that I've got is, um, army, army favoured, I think, like military favoured. We've got 11% of the no power, that's good. Trade is almost a dollar. Sweet. Okay, that's some pay. Yep. Let's go. Holy crap, I have an ear. He would be Carlos. Oh shit, um. Fuck. Was not expecting that army that big, that fast, to come down here. Now, their leader is. Shit, um. Okay, I need mercenaries fast. Take loan. Yep. Awesome. Cool beans. Okay, come on. Now, if this becomes a losing war, I will definitely call my, on my allies. France! Just need to 
postponed this war. Oh, military leader has died. That's not good. That's not good. Come on. You can pull this victory out of your ass. Just roll higher than them. An 8 is pretty freaking good. It sucks that we have no military leader now, though. Come on. Come on, ally, get in here. Need your heal. Or not. Time to chase after these guys and completely wipe them off. Because, um, wipe them off the map. Because if we kill his army, he has nothing to do. Nothing to really attack us with. Which is what we're looking for. Now my mercenary forces are gonna They're gonna cost a bit of money, but Bugger really? Didn't act the fort on them, did I? No. Let's just fast forward a couple of days here and see where that takes us, eh? Sixteen versus eighteen, we won that. Yep. You were ten percent down. Doesn't matter. Mm, my fleet is suffering now. I was afraid of that. Hopefully my ships can get away and come back to port, which they have, which is good. Yay. Ooh. Gonna be a battle there. Let's hope my general outdoes his general. Shit, two land negatives, but I'm still winning. Radio. Never let an ally fight a battle by himself. Okay, leave troops there. Now break off all the mercenaries. Actually, they might need help. Just in, case, just in case, if this army moves onto them, they've got haven't got an army to uh, really defend them. Well, my ally actually has an army. If anything happens, I can break away, leave an army sieging like that. And follow. Yep. Now I send my troops in to help. Holy crap, we are having a few battles with them, aren't we? money am I losing? Fair bit. Hopefully this war will be over soon. 
Oh, well, you know, time is already up. Um, no, I'll just extend this for a couple more minutes. Just so that we can um, see where things are, because uh, if anything, if I take at least that, I'll be happy. These four provinces means he only has three left. Is it? But what I want is the full conquest of it. Or even just taking the seaboard and the northern half would be excellent. The thing is, have I got. Or exhaustion. Yep, done. I'm not going to boost ability yet. Let's hope these guys have what it takes, which they do. Yep, and help, go in and help him. Come on, get there before he gets wiped out. Come on, there we go. Yeah, I think I want that to run around for a while. Okay, we've got 7%, they've got 14. We're about to take all these back, which is good. Yeah, once we capture these two cities, I'll pause it there and take it off from next stage, which will be part seven. Yes, part seven. But, yeah. Um, while this is quickly running through, I would just like to say, oh, that's interesting. Hmm, I was not expecting that. But anyway, um... Thank you for watching and all that good stuff. I really appreciate it. I actually, I really do. And um, yeah. I don't know. Thanks for watching. Um, if you enjoy videos like this of me playing EU4 and uh, this gameplay, yeah, hit the like button. And if you want to see, if you like the video, click like. If you want to subscribe click subscribe to just follow more games like this and yeah more will be coming out when I have time to record and um, put these on YouTube so yeah thanks for watching and um, catch you next time bye